So we're going to start this off with a couple more little packs. This is how we used to start every video, I'm pretty sure. Or at least, well, in Garden Warfare 2 anyway. You're going to give me the old uh, dragon fruit. Oh, they just gave us another heart choke. I'm not a dickhead, right? That's a heart choke. Right, so we now have two of these. Just to reiterate, from all the new cards that I've seen so far, this is probably one of the best ones. What this new update has basically done is it's basically said, if you want to win at this game, make a healing deck. And the focal point of that deck is the heart choke. Give me the dragon fruit this time, or you could always give me another heart choke. I mean, I'm cool with that. Maybe another Astro Vera. You gave me a banana. Right, not even a banana, a banana peel. So welcome back to PVZ Heroes. Last time we did a bit of a pack opening, basically trying to get some of the new cards, and then this time I said we were going to play with some of the cards. I'm going to play on plants, and hear me out. I haven't built a healing deck, but there's a particular combo that I have in mind that I want to see if I can pull off. It's basically, I'm sure people know what it is. I've got the Dandelion King, the Heartachoke, and the Astro Vera. The combo I want to pull off with this, and this will be like mad late game, because you need shit loads of sun to do this. Basically, the idea is to have a heart choke out in the field and then to play dandelion king followed by astro vera and it's an instant win because basically what heart choke does is it takes any damage that you heal and it deals it as damage to the other person that is not a bad starting hand i'll go with that so then you get the dandelion king who just cuts your opponent's hp clean in half as soon as you play him and then you play the astro vera who heals you for 10 um what do i want to do about this um he's gonna get stronger when i play him so uh, i guess we'll play god please no i guess we'll play shroom for two no uh, I guess we'll play Shroom for two. No! I guess we'll play Shroom for two, why not? No! <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, sh**, I'm an idiot. I just... <sighs> Did it not occur to me that playing a Shroom for two is gonna... I, I, I can't believe it. I can't believe you've done this. I was like, oh, I'll play the Shroom for two, you know. I'll probably have to buff him, and I didn't realise that playing two plants would buff him by two points. Do you know what? I'm, I'm an... I'm a, wow. I mean, at least I can kill him with this thing. I mean, thank Christ. The game had to compensate for my stupidity then. Cosmic Flower, all right? We could do something with that. He's got a gravestone down. I'm not entirely sure what I want to be doing about that. There are no zombies here. Then make a sunflower here. I mean, I could play that in the middle lane. I'll tell you what. We're going to play this in the middle lane, because then I'm going to play this as well. Hopefully, that'll make shrooms in the lanes that... No, that wasn't the lanes that I wanted. Okay, well, at least we block the, uh, the gravestone one. That's something. I can't believe what I did on the first turn. That was just... I'm wrestling zombies like one of my most used cards and it didn't occur to me that shroom for two was literally the worst thing that i could have played against it so there's our sunflower so that will give us one extra and i've got kernel corn okay this is interesting see i can keep hold of that and that can turn the game around pretty much any time i want if you made at least six sun this turn it gets strike through i'll tell you what we'll play cosmic flower yeah we'll play it there i'll conjure up something else which will also have strike through. Oh, wow, okay. See, what would be nice now is if he could actually take out the shroom and the sunflower. So if I can play the weed in the environment lane, then he gets plus three. And he's got strike through, so we could be looking good there. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that, that's really not good. <laughs> Zombie gets minus two each way. I'm going to play on him. I have to play on him. I was going to play it on the other one just to kind of take him out, but I have to weaken that one. <laughs> I don't want to be dealing with that. That's kind of ideal because I can just take it out anyway. So he's got a load of tricks, so it's like, I'm not sure. I'm going to controversially play this guy because he gets strike through because I made six sun. Oh, I can still play this. All right, that's cool. All right, I'll take him out. I have more sun than I thought I did. See, if I can just stall this out until late game, yeah, I knew he was going to destroy that one. You're just... <sighs> I knew he was going to do that, man. And now he's buffing it again. Dude, could you just give it a rest? Oh, this thing is absolutely killing me. Oh, we got Astro Vera. I don't know if you guys can hear the audio, but it's proper messed up at the moment. <laughs> so basically, now all I need to do is just survive for one more turn. I'm going to play this here, just to kind of cop block that thing. But then I don't know what tricks he has, so it's like... This is the thing that always bugs me about the game, is when they've got, like, tricks in their hand, and he's still got six brains, it's like, I have no idea what he's going to do. He could just pull anything out. I mean, I think I'm sitting in a better position than him right now. He's moving it and drawing a card. Okay, that's fine. I mean, it's not exactly like he was making a game-changing impact anyway. So he's now down to four. He's going to be so pissed when I play the Astro Vera. <laughs> he's going to be so upset. Oh my god, I got another Colonel Corn. Oh, for Christ's sake. This is just unfair, because I can play Astro Vera this turn, and then I could play Colonel Corn next turn, and then I could play another one the following turn. All right, so we're doing it. We're playing Astro Vera. We're playing it in this lane. There it is. First time I've ever played this card. That's going to put me back up to 17, and it should actually survive the little trash can thing. Unless he pulls some bullshit 
which I know he wants to, and he probably will. All zombies get plus two health. All right, so he's going to survive a bit longer. You do realize I'm just going to play Colonel Corn. You can do that all you want, mate. I literally couldn't care less. The audio is so messed up right now. Still got my sunflower. That, uh, that shroom's still alive somehow. Load him up. And... Every single one of them. Well, not every single one of them, but most of them are gone. So he's probably sitting there in his pants now. Come on, please just fill up your field so I can play another kernel corn. The banana rocket's all good. Take that out. I'm actually going to leave it there. There's not really much point in doing anything else this turn. All zombies get plus two. He's got one card left in his hand. Oh, well, that's it. That's his last card. Kill the hero for six. So he's now got nothing in his hand. And he's got no shield left. This is perfect. Am I going to win my first game back? I meant to actually say, this is my first online game since like March. I haven't played this game since I was like uploading it on the regular so they're almost gone that one's got armor so he survived i really want to play a weed in this environment lane but i can't so he's dropping that i mean that's all he can do to be honest i can't even do anything zombie gets plus two and frenzy oh i f can hate you. So he's down to six now. And he's playing the kangaroo. That gets bounced when you hurt it, but actually, do you know what? I can just I can just destroy that. Oh, I can destroy that as well. Oh, fine. Done. Done deal. The kangaroo isn't a problem because that'll die. Play this thing because it's the strongest thing I've got in my hand right now. He's now down to two health. He's got one card. Nothing out in the field. I'm sitting here good to go. He's gonna drop that. Yeah, it's pretty much game. I can just do this. See you bye. And there you go, first game back and we actually managed to win. I'm actually staggered, to be honest. I don't normally win in this game. Still stuck in Silver League. I just haven't been playing, honestly. But nice to win the first game back. So anyway, that's going to be it for this video. Nice to jump back on Heroes again. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new to the Wolfpack. And thanks always for watching, guys. Have a good one. I'll catch you next time.